Welcome back to the Sam LaSanne Show, folks. I'm here at Schuylkill County, uh, Schuylkill Chamber of Commerce. Uh, my good friend Bob Carl invited us here to talk to positive people. And I can't emphasize enough, surround yourself with positive people. One positive person here, very positive, Amy Lafko, who is the founder and CEO of Karen Consulting Solutions. So, Karen, I mean, uh, Amy, Tell me about yourself and tell me about Karen's Consulting Solutions. Absolutely. So um, my name is Amy Lafko. I'm from the county. And um, three years ago, I started this company. So interesting times to be going through. But my goal is to help people. And businesses need to see that skilled leadership is the way that they're going to be successful. So my motto is simply grow your people to grow your business. And I Good help model. companies. I know. And, you know, it's true. I think if, Very you, true. if you are willing to take the time to grow your people, you're going to grow your business. Yeah. And um, through this whole experience with, with the pandemic, I've seen it even more. Yeah. I have some of my clients who I've been working with for a while, and we've either redesigned their leadership team, we've provided training for how to have really healthy conflict or how to serve your team better. Those companies are doing really well. I have clients adding locations or doing expansions and not necessarily in industries where it's like they're the grocery store. Yeah. Um, but it's all about how you treat your people. Who would need you? I work with all different kinds of industries. I'm a physical therapist by background, so lots of healthcare. But if you understand that you want to grow your business, if you understand that your people matter, then I'm the person you want to work with because I'm going to help you make sure that you're doing that really well. I give you the leadership skills, the communication skills, and I help you design a business that puts your people first. Your uh, expertise um, would be a plus uh, and a positive mm -hmm. for businesses that uh, you have enough to do to run a business then to, to, to grow. Uh, do you need a, a certain amount of employees in your business, or could you have one employee, two employees, four? I mean, how many people do you need? I work with companies as small as three, yeah. and I work with companies that have over 900 or 1,000. Give me an example of, uh, sure. and you have to mention the, the company. Give me an example of a person who had a concern, a problem, what you did to resolve it. Absolutely. So I had a, a client who, when they were looking at shutdown, and they were going to have to close their practice for a little while. It was a healthcare practice. Okay. And they said, you know, what do we do? How do I lay people off? I don't know how to have this conversation. What's the strategy for when we do bring them back? And we worked through a communication strategy and a communication plan. 100% of their people came back. Even the ones who my other clients would say, well, at $13 an hour, it's cheaper for them to, or it's better for them to be at home. They had everyone come back. Everybody wanted to come back because they knew how committed they were as owners. Mm -hmm. And that's how I'm helping people right now. Mm -hmm. What are some of the um, things right now that you're working on or that would sure. be, especially with this pandemic and uh, there's a lot of fear out there and I keep telling people to be positive and, and they say it's, it's hard to be positive when you hear all this news, negative news. I don't know how much of that is, is, is factual anymore. I'm in the media business and I'm discouraged with the, yeah. with the uh, Main Street media, what they're doing and I, I, I just, I'm just totally confused. But to be positive, yeah. what, what, what should we do? So one of the most important things is to recognize we can't be happy and excited all the time. Yes. Um, we can't? We can't. Yeah. I don't know. No, I mean, it's Bob true. Oh, well, that's a different story. <laughs> yeah. But I tell you, I, I encourage my, um, my business owners and my leaders to talk to their team. Where are you today? Is today a day where you're feeling like we can do this or is it a day where you're in the valley of despair? And then you work around that so that you can move everybody into that we can do this phase. Mm -hmm. And part of the way you do that is with alignment. So right now, a lot of my clients are actually working on what are the non-negotiables of our business our size? What are the challenges we should be focused on? And it's about getting aligned. January 1 isn't going to be, you know, a whole new world and a vaccine isn't going to save us in a day. So we have to really be aligned as a team so that we can actually survive and thrive in this. You know, and when you said about growth, not all my clients are adding new locations. 
but they're not going backwards. Yeah. They've either added revenue or they've grown and added a new service or they're doing something that's moving forward instead of backwards. Yeah, it's funny, a person said to me, you're a lucky guy, Sammy, and I said, you know, it's a funny thing, the harder I work, the luckier I become. Uh -huh. you know? It's so yeah. true. You know, uh, many years ago, I had the pleasure of doing motivational speaking. Mm -hmm. And believe me, I, I would feel like I'm stealing money because I used to get so excited doing the motivational speakers, okay? And the thing said, well, what do I have to be motivated for? Well, believe it or not, as you do, when you go out and you talk to people and you make them feel good about mm -hmm. themselves, and that's what you do. Yeah. You know, and it's so it's it, and it's priceless sometimes. Okay, I mean, I, I'm not what your rates are, but I'm sure they're very reasonable. The point is, you make people feel good, so they want to do things. Absolutely. If you put your team together, you can do anything. If you are on the same page with your team, if you know how to communicate with them, you can weather any storm. 